In today's video, we're going to pick up where we left off in the previous video. Before we do that, I'll show you a couple highlights from the previous video. Would you be willing to tell everybody who your grandfather is? My grandpa is Malin Miller, who used to own Newmar not that long ago. Trying to compete with a Newell or a Prevo. This is the second one they ever made. And they only ended up making 17 of them. This is actually the first RV that ever had comfort drive, correct? Yeah. The economy crashed. These things weren't really viable anymore. This was my parents' demo unit, and they had it for maybe two or three years, and they sold it in 08 because Newmark was trying to get as much money as they could. Bought it back two years ago. Really a cool story, just so much history behind this coach. It's way ahead of its day. Totally Prevo, Newell style, the outside camera. So that TV is pretty dirty because we never use it. <laughs> Bridge, the medic. This is even carpeted inside of here. Oh, look at this with the London air. Wow. These are air slides like the Prevo and, and Newell. This thing has a 20 kilowatt generator, which is a big boy. For Newmar, before and now, they have a flap here that when it goes in, there's a seal here that seals it. And that's a lot cheaper to make, and it's a lot more reliable, in my opinion, because I'm not saying that Newell and Prevo aren't reliable, but if something happens with your air system, you might get leaks. He's opening this engine hatch all by the press of a button. Really cool thing, I think some of the Prevos have this. So, oh, yeah. So this thing will, will suck itself in. If you haven't noticed this, but my grandpa invented this so that the door so that the door has clearance to the slide out yeah. very cool oh wow no way that is sick so the really nice thing about this door is you can do all your jacks here this pioneered like 2005 look at this no way Try to integrate the vents into these lines. Oh yeah, look at that. Pretty cool. They would have made three demos. Which they had demos and they would try out new stuff and then they would go on a production coach after that. So a lot of testing went into stuff. We don't, they, Newmar didn't just slap stuff on, a, on an RV. We tested it for years beforehand. The Newmars before this would have had a split windshield like that. So this is the first solid windshield. Uh, another thing is this thing has air doors which I don't, no other Newmar has oh that. Oh my goodness. I know the uh, the Prevos and Newells have that, but that's... What? The really cool one is in the back here. This is why, like... And they're a little slow, it's not instant, but this thing is worth the wait. This door is so cool. Wow. That is... Oh my goodness, guys. I hope you're all as excited as I am because this is like such, so much history in this coach. Like, just so cool to see all this firsthand. Really appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. I can, uh... oh, where are these? Yeah, right here. Okay, my, the coolest RV door I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, this is the bathroom. Oh, uh, my mom and dad, when they got this, we they had little kids. So they didn't want a bathroom in the back, which some of them offered. So, and this is also a tub, which was- Oh, wow. That's a piece of trim that came off. We're just storing it yeah. in there. But yeah, this thing has a tub for little kids. Wow, huge and, washer yeah. and dryer. Yep. And then uh, a lot of wardrobes. Yeah, look at all here. that. Wow. Yeah. Cedar closets, yep. I can see. Yeah. Just tons of wardrobe space. Uh, this thing right here is a TV. We don't use it, but there's a TV behind there. That's pretty cool. This is your uh, intercom thing out in the front doorbell. Nice. And oh, that is cool. So here they use the, a screen system which is new, all the new ones have that, but that was, would have been the first one. I, there's one up front too that I can show you a little more. It's uh, It does pretty good as far as for how old it is, but um, yeah. You it's can like adjust. a Crestron or? Yeah, yeah. 
like you could check your tank levels you can turn on your generator actually from here your oasis your uh, awnings you could do from here wow. there's your heat and air and stuff wow yeah. so so far ahead of yeah. its time this is awesome uh, to, uh, check out that backsplash that's beautiful tile work there's <laughs> one thing i want to show you that's really cool if you right here is a button that's called movie yeah so you hold that guy in right there all the lights go off, all the shades go down, and the TV comes down. So I think that's pretty cool. This is super cool. It's got the full blackout button. Kind of like it's probably getting dark in here quickly, but this is like totally blackout mode. This is awesome. Like totally dark in here. Guys, it was an absolute honor. Theodore, I can't thank you enough for showing us this awesome 2005 Newmar London Air. Uh, Theodore and his family are true pioneers of the RV world and greatly appreciate you. You know, well, without you. your family, the RV community wouldn't be anywhere where it is today. So well, greatly appreciate you guys. Any last words for the YouTube subscribers? Uh, make sure you subscribe to Andrew, who's a great video maker. Hey, uh, <laughs> greatly appreciate it. Thank you all for watching. Thank you to the Miller family. Thank you to Newmar. Appreciate y'all. Hope you're all having a great day. Make sure to subscribe if you want to see more cool RV related content and meet more cool people like this. <laughs>